Let's uh let, let me check that out real quick. Let me see. Uh, I feel like Timberwolves would be a tough matchup. NFL. Tough matchup too. Schedule strength. Uh, man, that's tough. We can talk about that a little bit. Team Bills got a gauntlet. She got the toughest schedules. Strength of schedule. I saw it was like a chart. Dog. The mosquitoes this year have been insane. But I saw a chart somewhere. And it was um I don't, I don't I don't even know where I saw it at. I don't know if that was on YouTube, Twitter, whatever, Instagram. I have no clue. How many ones I think Falcons getting? Uh, I gotta see the schedule. I gotta see the schedule. I saw a chart somewhere. You can hear the stream in the background. Really? I don't know. I don't even know where I saw it at. I don't know if that was on YouTube. Oh. I ain't even peeped that. My fault. Thank you for thank you for saying, for telling me. How many ones I think is getting? Appreciate you, bro. RJ, yes sir. Appreciate you, my guy. Thank you for letting me know that's way. It's gonna be tough, no matter what. Both good teams, definitely, definitely. Yeah. No, no matter which route you go, it's gonna be a tough matchup. Thank you, RJ. T was got number one defense. They tough. It's just the the their uh their bigs, man. You got some you got some quality bigs, and then your guards are are good too. You know, like so it's like then you got you know you got a good wing defender. You know, I mean they good. So teams with the easiest schedule this year, the Falcons have the easiest schedule. Oh, by far, low key. Like there's a there's a there's a gap right there. Seems to be. Um hey man, Falcons, Falcons making playoffs. Uh Chargers. Bears. Bears Bears. I don't know about the Bears, man. I mean, they got a shot. Like they got a nice roster, but you're in the same division with the Lions and a and the Packers. That's not that's not gonna be easy work at all. That's not Jets, oh man, that's gonna be interesting. They getting they getting Aaron Rodgers back, like that's gonna be interesting. Let me think. Jets, Bills. I think that division that that uh, I think that I think that could be up in the air, bro. You said the Bills and the Bills got a tough schedule too. Mm. That division could be up in the air. I'm not gonna lie. MJ, what's up, bro? My bad, my bad. If I ain't say what's up to you. What's up, dude? Calvo, how we doing? How we doing? How we doing? So yeah, good size, yeah. Yeah, that storm was crazy the, the, the other day, bro. Uh, I didn't really experience too much of it. I went to the gym while it was going on, and it, it was crazy as I was going into the gym. And uh, I was in there for like two hours, and by the time I came out, it was over with. But the next day, when I say so many people did not have power, but I mean, it's what it is. You know, that kind of stuff happens. It's unfortunate. Raiders making playoffs and AP we trust. Where the Raiders at? Ooh, Raiders got a tough schedule. Raiders got tough. The hardest schedules, the Steelers, Patriots, Browns, Ravens, Vikings. Mm. The Browns are in a tough. Actually, I'm about to say the Browns are in a tough spot because Deshaun Watson keeps getting hurt, but I forgot they signed Jameis Winston and Tyler Huntley. So they probably got the best quarterback room in the league as far as depth. You know what I mean? So, I mean, if he gets injured, you still got two guys you could potentially rely on to uh, move the ball for you. But, you know, I'm curious why the Patriots have such a hard schedule and they they have a rookie quarterback. I like I like the Patriots though. You know, I'm I'm definitely looking forward to watching them play. But uh I mean you kinda kinda putting them in an odd spot there. Vikings another one that's kinda iffy. But the Vikings are always competitive. Rosen side chilling with people, how's this gonna do yeah kinda kinda. Yeah. No, I was, it was definitely was crazy though. I like I said, I, I saw some neighborhoods that was bad. They said downtown was it was terrible. I didn't go to uh, obviously didn't go down there. There's no reason for me to go all the way over there. But yeah, seen the college football trailer yet? 
I actually have that pulled up right here. We're gonna get to that, but uh, we're gonna get to that most stuff, most stuff. Um, I, I honestly, bro, I could I could legit see the Falcons making the playoffs. Um, uh, I'm not gonna try to like predict any records or anything, but I can see Falcons making the playoffs. Uh, Chargers. Let me see. You got the Chiefs. They're not. They're not. They're not gonna outplay the Chiefs. Chargers. Chargers are gonna have to bank on their young receivers balling out. That's what they're gonna have to bank on. They they will have a run game, which is which is good. They will have a run game. Uh, should have some protection for Justin Herbert, which will open up stuff for these young receivers. But uh, I mean that's 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 what it's gonna be for them. They're gonna have to bank on the uh on their their young guys coming in there and actually doing work. Bears. So again, going back to Chargers, I don't I don't know how I feel about them as far as playoffs. They could be they they're gonna be competitive. But I don't know, I don't know about playoffs right now. Bears. I I wouldn't really count on it just because they're they got the the Packers and the Lions to worry about. Jets, Jets could possibly win that division. Possibly, Aaron Rodgers healthy the whole season, especially with what they added. They added so much offensive depth. Oh my gosh, um, they could possibly win that division. So I think that's realistic. Brock Bowers and Michael Mayer duo. It's gonna be wild. MJ, I'm gonna get to that in a second. Let me let me get back to you on that TikTok. Actually, let me see. Hold on. This is what I think it is. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Some dealing with the storm. Bro, he's getting dark. But you can't see it on camera, but it's getting dark. Oh, that is crazy. Oh, it's coming right under us. You know what's crazy? It literally was like that. It was dark outside. Like, dark. So dark. And it's like, I come outside two hours later, and it's, it's, day, it's daylight. I'm like, what the heck? That is wild. It's about to go. Oh my yeah, gosh. That's crazy. No deal. Yo, what up, Katie? What's up, Daniel? Uh they actually going to charge in Raiders week one. Oh, that's gonna be fun. That's gonna be a fun game to watch. It's it's gonna be a lot of fun games to watch this year, bro. In my opinion, I think it's a lot of good matchups. I mean, like like as of right now, every roster has something something to look forward to. Legit, yeah. Well, it's crazy, bro. Uh, let me see. Saints, Saints potential playoff team. Uh, very very much. I see the, I see potential there for them to be a playoff team, but I like the Falcons' odds a little bit better right now. So we'll see. Bengals. Bengals got an easy schedule. Why did why did they give them an easy schedule? What the heck? Uh, I mean, I guess. Like they're a competitive team. Like that's kind of kind of odd. They give them a top six easy schedule. I mean, same thing with the Jets, but the Jets are a little bit unproven because Aaron Rodgers didn't play last year. But the Bengals. I mean, we know they've been a pretty good team. In the past few years, it's based off of every every four years. Lucky mad Panthers ain't get a prime time. Why you want to see Panthers play prime time? Uh, Colts. I don't know. That the the AFC South is is very tough right now. I don't even I don't know what to think about about them. They're gonna be very competitive. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking, like the conversation right now is playoffs. I don't know if I can see Colts going to the playoffs. It's possible. They got a competitive roster, very competitive, and then they added, they added weapons. But uh, that's just something we got to see. That's, that's up in the air. I don't, I don't see them beating out the Texans. Like maybe one and one, but for sure not sweeping them or having a better record than them. I don't think they're, I don't think they're better than the Texans. But I mean. Obviously, if they got the number seven schedule and Texans got twenty eighth, they possibly could have a better, better season. I don't know. We'll see. 
AR-15 break out. I hope he breaks out, bro. I like. I actually like that roster. I really do. Um, even though it's like a division rival, I actually like the Colts roster. Them boys, they pretty. Um, uh, they got some talent. They got some talent. Like it, it's gonna be fun to watch. Dolphins got eighth. Oh my gosh, got another playoff team in here. Man, I mean, obviously they're they're um, uh, they could def- Oh wait 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 wait. Hold on hold on. Dolphins are in the AFC East. That's oh oh. Oh, that division is gonna be tough. With the, with the Jets coming back, it's gonna be tough. Bills, mm, Bills in an odd spot right now. They're in an odd spot. Eagles, easy schedule. Panthers, easy schedule. Why the white thing behind you look like a sink behind you? <laughs> no, it's a uh, it's a pla- It's like a plastic tote. Tote. I don't know. Whatever, whatever you want to call it. Um, hold on, I'm looking for that. You say got a feeling the offense is going to be exciting for the Panthers. Uh, I look forward to see, I look forward to watching them, but I don't I don't I don't look forward to watching them prime time. But I do I do feel like they they'll be competitive. Definitely. Uh, let me see. Chiefs got an easier schedule. Oh my gosh! Bucks, Bucks, Bucks would be fun to watch. Panthers, so they made life a little easier on the Panthers. Now this is interesting though. So the whole NFC South is above the line. So I mean, that division could be very competitive this year. I mean, they're always competitive. Like they be getting in the playoffs with losing records. If I'm not mistaken, or they did last year. I can't remember, but uh. Or like five hundred, but even though their teams aren't always like good, they they're consistently competitive. I said watch the Giants prime time. Giants, that's that's another team. I, I'm not. I wouldn't be excited to watch them prime time. I I I look. Who did they get? They got neighbors. I look forward to seeing how how. I mean, actually, I don't know. Because they got neighbors. They got Tracy at running back. I mean, I don't know. Devin Singletary could be solid. I don't know what to expect. Um, Commanders. Tougher schedule. Jags. Commanders gonna be fun to watch. They're gonna be fun to watch. Just just Jaden Daniels, man. They're gonna be so fun to watch. Um uh, It's gonna be interesting. You get like kind of a Lamar 2.0. It's gonna be like he's probably like the the most similar uh quarterback to Lamar like that's came in the league so far since Lamar's been in the league like he's the most similar i think he throws a little better though it's my opinion jags seahawks cardinals cardinals are going to be fun to watch seahawks i think so too it's 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 like i said it's a lot of competitive components to each team bro like if I go over all of these teams, it's just it's a lot that I can see. Um, you know, I can't see the Broncos making playoffs if I'm being real. Vikings can't really see it. Titans again, that's iffy. It's possible. That's it's gonna be a competitive division. Uh, Bills is iffy, very iffy right now, just cause the Jets are coming back and they still gotta worry about the Dolphins. Raiders, uh. Nah, I don't really see Raiders making playoffs. That's just my personal opinion. I'm not. I'm not saying that they are, you know, bad or anything. I mean, I just, I just don't see it. You know, uh, Cowboys, yeah. Lions, yeah. Giants, no. Packers, Niners, Rams. Oh, full season with with that Rams roster healthy. That's gonna be interesting. That's gonna be very interesting. Then, um, I want to see how do, how those rookies how those rookies play on defense. Kaden thinks Carr is a trash quarterback. Oh, uh, he hasn't he hasn't been good with the Saints yet, but uh, I mean we'll see. He he got to be healthy, bro. 
that's that's the key. You got to be healthy for us to like get a a clear evaluation on him. But not nah, his 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 past season with them was not very good. Feel bad for that. We're gonna do for next week one. I see something that the uh the Seahawks want to bring back Jamal Adams, and they think about putting him ex- exclusively a linebacker. I could be wrong, but I thought I thought I saw that somewhere. Solid eight and nine, nine and eight Panthers. I'd have to see that schedule. I don't feel like going through schedules right now, but uh, that'd be interesting. That'd be very interesting. Uh, nine wins would be crazy, considering how how bad they played last year. They got a new head coach, Spencer Rattler, take over. That'd be interesting. I'm not a, I'm not a, a full believer in Spencer Rattler right now. But I mean, you know, I'm 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 all for uh, you know, guys, uh, you know, getting the opportunity, and um, and making the most of it. All right, let's go ahead and move on to the. Uh, I want to move on to the uh, college football reaction. <laughs> 